Writing G-code from your CAM software is an important step before a machinist can transfer the instructions to a CNC machine. Let's review a few steps in Onshape CAM Studio where settings will affect G-code. First, when defining the job, you have the option to select how the stock body is defined and how the coordinate system is defined in relation to the stock body. You can specify the orientation of the coordinate system by selecting the edges of the stock body. This will ultimately impact the coordinates output in the G-code. Next, when selecting the machine, several post settings can be configured. For example, it's possible to write the G-code with block numbers at tools only. Review these settings before you output G-code. Choosing settings that work best for your specific post processor. Next, we'll specify a point on the stock body as the datum for the coordinate measurement. Select the bottom point in the front. You are now ready to start creating tools and toolpaths. When creating toolpaths, you can configure speeds and feeds, as well as turn on coolant, and so on. Finally, after all the toolpaths are created and simulated, we can export a file containing the machining instructions. This file can be imported into CAM Studio and version controlled alongside the CAD and CAM models.